Hi, I'm Wayne Denier with the Full Sail University Online Fundamentals of Physics course, and I'm going to be performing a physics experiment today called the water prism. You'll need five materials for this experiment, a piece of paper, scissors, tape, a flashlight, and a glass of water. Uh, it's good to pick a flashlight that has an adjustable beam so that you can fine-tune the effect of the light in the experiment. You'll start by taking a piece of paper and cutting it to the size of the head of the flashlight and then cutting a slit in it like so. Then you'll take some tape and use as much as you need to get it fastened tightly on the top of the flashlight. Then uh, place the glass of water on the edge of the table, then place the flashlight like so on a steady surface next to the glass and you'll see that the flashlight projects a beam of light through the glass and onto the surface behind producing a rainbow effect like so. Uh, if you'd like, you can put a piece of white paper on the wall so that it'll make the effect more pronounced. There's two properties of light that are demonstrated in this experiment, and those are refraction and dispersion. Refraction says that light travels at different speeds and different materials, and dispersion says that different frequencies of light travel at different speeds from each other. So, when the light hits the glass, it is going to change speed, and since the glass is curved, refraction is going to actually change the angle of the light slightly. Uh, dispersion says that the different frequencies of light, red through green, blue, and yellow, and purple, are all going to move at different speeds, and so the different types of colors separate in the spectrum as it goes through the glass, the water, and the glass again as it goes out the other side. So you'll get to see a thin rainbow effect on either side of the beam of light because of the refraction and the dispersion. And that concludes my experiment. Thank you for watching.